Now these will get approximately red hot. I'm here taking the head off one side of my Sison V2 and the reason is because I've been getting uh, popping little tufts of blue smoke and little tufts of blue exhaust smoke coming out of the carburetor intake, the air intake. So I know that um, I can also feel from the compression uh, that this side is not working as well and i can see from the colors that have gone hotter on the other side's exhaust the process to get that head off well you can either go for the four big screws down here but i would say they're pretty hard they're pretty hard to get to so what i did is i there's five five little screws here i cracked them open using a hex key the modified hex key i used to run those loosened ones out is just there i've left it in that socket and that lets me undo them even when they're at a funny angle okay when you if and when you do open this up you really want to check the inside of that um, that cylinder and I think that that machining is excellent and I have no uh, scraping which is great news because I did have some problems I think a bit of rubber got in there I did have some problems with it locking up uh, earlier on you can see how the carb is just pushed in that's the exhaust. There's the carb intake there. I'm going to put a bit of seal on that when I put it back in. But for now, I'm going to try my tried and true method after a bit of cleaning of um, working on that little valve there. Um, this, just, this just sort of pulls off when you've taken out all the screws. I've put the push rods over there. Obviously, I've got to get them back. Um, but for now, we're going to use a little bit of petrol and clean up this side. Uh, might figure out whether I'm going to take those off. Uh, possibly it might be a good idea to. And um, we'll get back. I'll get the camera back on when I'm ready to work on those valves. This, the hex key with a spring in the middle of it for undoing for undoing screws at funny angles is the second tool I've made well modified this has had a part of it screwed out so that it works as a as a spark plug wrench yeah the screw head I've got is the same size focus damn you is the valve So that's going to be pretty good for super gluing that on there. It's also the valve is, yeah, the valve is slightly above the top of the cylinder. Um, so I think this is going to be really successful, a uh, very successful way of um, lapping that valve. Okay, so we have the heads super glued to the screw. The, the screw heads super glued to the valves and we're going to try a bit of pressure and a bit of jiff on those um, probably we'll use a power drill to spin them this time because we seem to have steel valves in a steel head not the same as we had with the other little engines which had either brass valves or brass head or both uh, I lapped the valves rather thoroughly uh, with power drill and I've cleaned them out with um, with petrol. The surfaces are at sort of a uniform dull grey under there. So Right, as for putting it back together, 
uh, I'm going to use some thread lock and possibly a little bit of silicon seal here and there make everything's tight make sure everything's tight and not going to wriggle off just a note i had a plumber that left this behind it's a sealer but it doesn't set so that you can't pull stuff apart this is the high this is the high temperature formulation it's like a white uh, goo almost looks like a silicon sealer but doesn't set so I'm going to use that uh, around here and here where the carburetor is a press fit into both cylinder heads. Um, that's going to ensure that there's no leaking. I'm also going to neaten up this, which is a bit uh, not neat on my one. Um, yeah, everything to help the sealing, uh, to help stuff not unscrew itself. All that kind of stuff. Now, as for a head gasket, I may, I may also use it for the head gasket. The head gasket is, I believe, aluminium. Yeah, I think that's aluminium. There's something about that that says to me, aluminium, nice and soft. And I think, I think I'll put a little smear of um, some kind of sealant on that. Probably the same one. Yeah, it doesn't get very hot. So, yeah, that's all cool. It's going to be better, stronger, faster, cleaner, etc.